It's time to celebrate the incredible and lasting impact that your wonderful ideas have had within your communities. Ideas that were brought to life through the Take 500 PB project. This is the second year of this project, which is organized through the ARMA, Bambridge and Craigavon Community Planning Partnership. And it is a special one because it gave you, our residents, the opportunity to decide how public funds could be used to help benefit your areas. This year, we received a staggering 119 application forms, communities right across the ABC borough, and the variety of ideas was simply remarkable, including public gardens, youth clubs, intergenerational projects, helping those with additional needs, supporting emotional well-being, weaving and so much more. Every idea was meaningful. In the end, over £76,000 of funding was allocated to 81 groups and all of these groups have left a little legacy for each community. A huge congratulations to everyone who has worked so hard over the past six months to brainstorm, apply and develop these wonderful ideas which have since become a reality. This video is a reflection of those fantastic ventures and a celebration of how they made a difference. I hope you enjoy. It's really, really important that local people have a say in how money is spent in their area. So they're getting to see where the money goes and they're getting the benefit from it. People from as young as eight year old were allowed to decide and um, what the project was to give them the sense of ownership. There are opportunities to look at physical activity, to look at learning, to look at connecting with each other. So loads and loads of programmes that are important to communities fit within that criteria. I think that will encourage people to see what they can do for the next year and the years beyond. I learned a lot about um, our community and the actual programmes that's going on within the Armagh Bambridge Craigavon Council. I think it's absolutely fantastic. The funding is to provide GEA fundamental sports for kids with special or additional needs from four years to 12 years. And our session, we run it for 16 weeks. They're actually coming from far and away to attend. received a thousand pound um, for our academies program to engage young people in extracurricular activities and um, things like business, youth work. I think it's a great opportunity for um, local community spending to be used in a way that benefits the local community. Uh, the events themselves, I know that there was unprecedented amount of people that turned up at it. Just people constantly coming up asking who we were, what we do. Okay, we're a group of deaf people within the local area. So we have people come along who enjoy themselves, enjoy communication. Um, also, we recently have now got transport with the minibus. The funding has helped the deaf people here in the deaf club because it means that they can learn like different crafts, uh, weaving, um, tapestry, different people coming in and hopefully there'll be more people to come in and show us different things. Take 500 funding that provide a brilliant platform for students to lead on projects. So leadership skills were absolutely developed and use money in such a positive way that has great outcomes. We done the Knit and Adder project, the Pebble Picture project with a care home in Bambridge and um, the Let's Integrate together. So the older people felt really important and felt really valued the fact that they could actually teach the younger generation like how to knit instead of us trying to teach them how to do stuff. Everyone had smiles on their faces, everyone was having fun. There was not a dull moment. It was all positive, it was all happy, it was all bright. Uh, we used the funding for classes uh, they, that's ranged from fitness classes, patchwork, arts and crafts and flower arranging. Oh, it's meant so much to a lot of people, particularly those who are living alone, that they were able to come out and socialise with others. Hey, apart from the new skills they have learned, the boost in self-confidence for a lot of people. We have the Sluice Keepers Cottage at Shark Lock or Acton Lake, and we use some of the funding to refresh that offering to the community. Um, 
presenting the history of the canal and our ongoing work. What makes the Take 500 Plus experience most meaningful is that it is the results of which are decided by the members of the public themselves. That level of, of local democracy is, 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 is just, it's wonderful to see 